Okay, today we're going to learn how to find the greatest common factor of three numbers. And I'm going to do this instead of a list, I'm going to do this with a t-chart. So I'm going to make a factor t-chart for 35, and then I'm going to find the greatest common factor of 35, 56, and 63. So my factors of 35 are 1 and 35. And I know the other factor pair is 5 and 7. And those are all the factors for 35. Factors for 56 are a little bit more. We have 1 times 56. I know that 56 is an even number, so I know 2 is going to be a factor. So I can do 56 divided by 2. and I get 28. Three is not a factor because five plus six is 11. And when you add the digits of the number that you're looking at and they're divisible by three, then the, fact, then the number is divisible by three, but 11 is not divisible by three. Four, I can check to see if 4 is divisible by 56. There's no secret trick for 4. So one of the best ones, if I don't want to do division, is to use my calculator. And I can type in 56 divided by 4 equals 14. All right. 5. Let's say I didn't know if it was divisible by 5 or not. Anything divisible by 5 ends in a 5 or a 0. So 56 is not divisible by 5, but I want to show you an example of what it would look like if I put it in the calculator. 56 divided by 5 equals. And you can see that there is a number past my decimal point in my answer, 11 and 2 tenths, 11.2. That, that is not a factor because it is not a whole number without a decimal point. So five is not a factor. Six, numbers are um, have a factor of six as long as they have a factor of two and three. And three is not a factor of 56, so neither is six. Seven, I know my times tables that seven times eight is 56. So I know seven and eight are both factors of 56. And then if I go to my next number, would be 8, and here I already have 8 in my number, so these are all the factors of 56. For 63, I have 1 times 63. It is not an even number, so 2 will not be a factor. If I add these together, 6 plus 3 equals 9, and 3 is a factor of 9, so that 3 is going to be a factor of 63. 3 times what? Again, I'm fine with you using your calculator for this part. 63 divided by 3 equals 21. 3 and 21. 4 is not a factor. It's not even. 5 is not a factor. It does not end in a 5 or a 0. 6 is not a factor because 2 is not a factor. 7 is a factor of 63. I know that 7 times 9 is 63. Okay, 8, we can check in our calculator for 8. 63 divided by 8 equals, look at that, we have a decimal answer. So that is not going to be a factor. It's not a whole number. So now we're back to 9, and those are all the factors of 63. Now I'm going to find my greatest common factors. I'm going to look at each list and see what numbers they have in common. Well, I see they all have a 1, as every number shares 1 as a, as a common factor. No 5s in the other lists, but I do see a 7 and a 7 and a 7. And since there's no 35 in any other, any other list, my greatest common factor for 35, 56, and 63 is 7.